Alright, what is going on Z Nation? I'm just here to just let you know about something here now. They do these bizarre offers all the time. And I was going through here and reading these. And I'm like, wow, these are pretty good deals actually. I mean, all these you know, like talent refresh cards, the legendary hero cards, all the uh, purple essence is really nice. And then you scroll down here to the 99.99 pack. And guys, that is a War God level crest set 3. 30 essence, 30 packs. I mean, look at that. That's right there, what, 60,000 honor badges. Um, shards, tons of shards, 15 packs of those, and 15,000 merits. And as I then, like, I've always seen them do that, where you can purchase these, you know, it's like a one-time purchase for this day. And then as you go up to the top and you read it, Get gems, items with these packs. Offers apply when you buy them from here. Note, you can only buy each pack three times. Now, I have never seen that before, or maybe I've misread it before. I've actually purchased these value packs from the bazaar before, and I've never seen to where you can purchase them three times each. So, I mean, not everyone can afford the $99 pack, but... I mean, here's a good opportunity to stock up on talent refresh cards, and you can get some level 3 mystery bags is good, and 3 legendary hero cards. So there's a lot of great things going on right now. So I'm going to get this video posted ASAP. And also, guys, if you want to take an opportunity of that, uh, down here at the bottom hiding as well is a sign and win. I already did mine today, but make sure you go ahead and do this. Because there is a chance to getting an Artica card, and I would love to see if anyone really wins an Artica out of this. But um, yeah, you just sign in, do that there, and I got gems the last two days, hundred gems each, so it's free gems. So, and real quick, guys, before we end this video, I did want to show something that I was pretty damn happy with and proud of. It is the first time ever, guys, in Guild Wars history that I got the maximum. Points. I hit the top five guys in the Guild Wars, got 100% on each base, and that is my max Guild Wars score for this Guild Wars going on right now. So, just very good improvements on my Guild Wars team. Oh, someone uh, beat my base 100% uh, good for them. But uh, they might have did it when I had my uh, Guild Wars heroes out, that's possible. But let me just show you guys real quick my Guild Wars heroes. And there's my Ares, War God 4 set, um, Pixie, beautiful Pixie, 8 of 10 War God, or 8 of 8 War God of 8 of 10 skill, got a 4 Bulwark on her, Warlock, 9 of 10 skill for 5 Revite, running 3 War God set, uh, let's see, we got Cupid, 9 of 10 skill for Revite, and a Life Drain to keep him alive, and then we got, um, Where's my tree at? Hiding. There he is. Tree, 7 of 10 skill for 6 of 8 revive. And a level 3 revive to get him to proc right away. And I do switch up between these two Skullnites. My main Skullnite is a 9 of 10 skill of 8 8 life drain. Got a, a level 4 deadly strike crest set. And then I also use this Skullnite. 8 of 10 skill for 5 of 5 corrode. And got a level uh, life drain crest set level three. So that is the team I'm using. And um, it's been working out very well. And I've only used this team with the current uh, crest and levels for this is my second attack. And it has went very well. I think I've learned a lot so far in Guild Wars. So anyways, guys, back to this. Um, definitely go take advantage of these awesome deals going on right now in Castle Clash and the Bazaar. So all right, guys, I'll catch you on the next video. Peace. Phones, Babylon can't crack